Hello and welcome back to Gotham Sound's coverage of NAB 2024. When you need power for sound, you turn to Gotham Sound um, and Hawkwoods. So anyway, I'm here with, I'm trying all sorts of new taglines. None of them work. It's all terrible, uh, except for the ones that the customers have given me, which have been good, but I've forgotten them all. Anyway, it's fine. Um, Phil Dodson from Hawkwoods, thank you for being here. No problem. My pleasure. Um, you're here from across the pond. Yep, from the UK. So we based uh, in the UK, Ashford in Kent, if anyone knows that. I've heard of them. Um, so we, uh, we um, uh, manufacture, uh, assemble, and we do our R&D in the UK. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's exciting to be here today. Um, it's exciting to be here um, demonstrating some of our new products. Yeah. So really exciting. Cool. Um, so who's your football team? Oh, that's got to be Liverpool. Oh, okay. Yeah. We All right. We, we won't talk. <laughs> <laughs> TK's, TK's giving him some side eye. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Not over the, over the last week, though, it's not, not been uh, too successful for us, but there you go. Oh. All right. I feel that way about the Mets, so what, what can you do? Uh, it's your team. Uh, all right. So um, I guess one thing, before we even talk about the new stuff, um, Paul was in our, our New York office uh, not that long ago, and one thing that he was really prided himself in is the quality of the, the cells that you guys use in your batteries. So I don't know if you'd want to talk a little bit about that. I, I know I just sprang this on you, but he was really um, adamant that, that uh, your cells are, are you know, best in class in the world. So anyway. Yeah, absolutely. So the, the cells, uh, as we know, uh, there's all different classification of cells. Um, so we pride ourselves on on uh, quality, robustness, and there's the classification cells. You know, you get your A grade, you get your B grade, you get your C grade, um, and there's a choice there. And uh, so we will always choose the best cells, uh, the best technology mm -hmm. um, for for the application that we need. So we we never. Um, we, we never cut corners when it comes to quality, and it's really important for us to, and there's different kinds of cells in each, each different battery as well. And uh, just for clarification, why would you, I mean, I know why, but for hypothetically, if you didn't know why, why would you want to choose a, a better cell over a less good cell? Yeah, okay, so it's, it's all about longevity, it's about the quality, it's about the output. Um, and it's also about sustainability these days. Okay, so it's really important for us to look at, at cells. If they last longer, that means um, we, we won't be using as many, okay, which is really important for our company. Uh, we've, got a, we've got quite an extensive CR, CSR program. Um, this is something we want to promote um, and not just talk about these things, but we actually want to be actioning these things to make sure that um, you know, we, we can sustain our technology uh, for the future. Yeah. Got it. And, and uh, you know, the other thing that we see a lot of these days is, is lithium battery fires. Yeah, yeah. You know? So it's safety first. Yeah, absolutely. So we, we all know there's problems there. And that's why it's so important, really, to make sure that, uh, you know, you're choosing the right company to, to purchase uh, batteries. Um, uh, because what you don't want to be doing is, uh, as everyone knows, uh, mix and match uh, and low-level low uh, battery technology, and it could cause problems. Right. Right. Okay. So anyway, that being said, that was really cool. And I enjoyed when, when Paul was in, uh, in New York yep. and told us about that. Uh, so what is new? Um, yeah. What's new? Yep. Should we start with something big? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So, uh, so we've got you um, really excited about this one. This is, uh, this is our Rampart. Uh, it's a floor battery. Mm -hmm. um, it's, uh, it's something that our customers have, have uh, asked us to look at um, for the multiple um, power uh, that they require in terms of not only cameras, but uh, lighting and uh, other accessories as well. And this gives us a great opportunity to work with our customers and say, look, what do you really want? Okay, so again, we strip this back. Um, this is a 1,000 watt hour um, uh, power plant. Uh, it's 26 uh, volts. We got two uh, XLRs. Um, in uh, that's delivering the, the 26 uh, volts, but we've also and that's nominal. So we've also then got uh, down to uh, 12 volt, uh, which mm. is regulated. Okay. Uh, that's really important for certain uh, equipment because uh, customers they they want to rely on that voltage, and what you don't want to do is uh, do something crazy and then blow <laughs> blow some, some systems. Right. The great thing about this as well is that we've again looked at sustainability and robustness and quality. Uh, so this is an aluminium case, it's not plastic. Okay. So the robustness and we've got the, uh, the uh, strong uh, 
uh, rubbers around it as well. So, um, and we got a choice of different handles uh, for, for whatever the customer actually requires. And can you say what it's made out of again? Because I just love hearing how it's said. Aluminium. Aluminium. That's there you so go. Brilliant. Well, it's my pronunciation. pronunciation of aluminium. It's so good. It's yeah. so good. I'm yeah. going to start saying it that way too. Yeah. Um, all right. So that uh, you know, for for our customer reference, the the NP1 battery has been the the gold standard for a long time. People yeah. are using yeah. a lot of uh, you know what people call smart batteries. Yep. Yeah. Uh, and those are now all clocking in at about 98 watt hours. So this one battery would be about 10 of those. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Absolutely. So. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and you, how much does it weigh? It's about 10 kilos? It's, it's around about 9.5 kilos. 9.5 yeah. kilos, yeah. Which, which converts to... So again, it's, it's, you, you can maneuver it around. You know, it's not a, f a fixed thing. Mm -hmm. And um, it, again, that's what a customer wants. So not only do we need all the outputs, we need all the capacity, but they also required something that was lightweight. Yeah. Um, uh, and that's, this is what we produced. Got it. Um, the other interesting thing, you know, one of the products that we sell a decent amount of it at Gotham is the uh, you have a regulated um, Sony L series sled so that people when they have a receiver that needs external power if they just need something quick they want to be able to throw a small battery on yep. most of them only output seven volts yeah 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 but you all make battery sleds that up convert that to twelve regulated yep yep yep, yep absolutely it's very cool yeah all right so next moving on. Yeah, so this is a BPU. So this is uh, uh, generally used for uh, Sony cameras. Okay, again, really excited about this because this is, uh, for us anyway, it's uh, very innovative. So um, this has been uh, redesigned. So, uh, you know, looking at the different features that we, we require. So this is new. So uh, it's a predecessor, just at the two D tabs here. So uh, this is the successor then. So we've now got um, USB-A, USB-C. Mm -hmm. And the great thing about this now, okay, is that uh, we've also increased the ampage to about 10 amps. Wow. Which wow. is, okay. it's double the ampage. Uh -huh. um, so there is nothing uh, that we produce that is come anywhere close to this. So we'd have, just over the last two days, we've had a lot of response on this uh, and a lot of inquiries. Uh, it's, you know, it's, it's one of those uh, innovative things, uh, which is something we, we feel quite proud about. Great. Okay. Yep. Perfect. Yep. Uh, and I mean, just a, it's an interesting fact that so many things are taking USB power now. I mean, yeah, if yeah. you look at my bag, I've got this transmitter that's double A's or USB. And, right. you know, trying not to use, you know, sustainability, trying not to use as many double A's. Precisely. Precisely. Um, they're also so expensive. Yep. yep. Um, and then, of course, my phone, which is, uh, you know, USB. how else am I going to be playing Angry Birds or whatever it is us kids are doing these days? Mm -hmm. Us kids, because we're, you know, yeah, whatever. Uh <laughs> Sorry, I'm feeling old these days. I don't know. It's fine. Join the club. Join the club. Exactly. There's the old man's anonymous club. Uh, all right. And so last but not least, okay. in terms of your new products, what do yeah. you have? So um, then we got the G-Lock. Okay. Mm -hmm. So again, um, again, we're excited about this, be, coming to the US and uh, displaying this. So this is the, the prototype that we got. So again, we, we, with, our, with our batteries, we really want to strip things back. We want to just do what a battery should do. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that is to power with confidence. Uh, again, robust quality. Um, so this is the G-Lock. What we got here is a four pin as well, which gives it 16 amps. Okay, so there's no, uh, you know, there's no uh, level of, um, you know, going up the ampage and back down the ampage. This gives uh, a standard 16 amps. Mm. Um, and the other three pins there all give the date that I'll put as well, okay? Um, so again, uh, really excited about this. It is a, a new market for us. Uh, this is something that we've only uh, just uh, produced. So... We want to bring this to get uh, some 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 uh, response from customers, see what they're thinking about it, and uh, thus far we we get a really good response, so, Great. which is exciting. Okay. So well, you yeah. have it in V mount as well, Peter asked. Well, we got we got a V mount battery, so uh, uh -huh. we we don't. So this is specific to to the G mount, uh, but we got quite an array of uh, V mount batteries adapters and everything else, which is one of our biggest sellers. Mm -hmm. So we know in the United States, the, the, the G mount is, is probably the most popular uh, mounted battery. So this is good for us, you know, and we want to just see uh, what our customers feel about this. Um, and um, we, we get in some good research and some response uh, over this um, over this show, so. Very cool, great. Um, so uh, just questions that we've been asking everybody, uh, what's your favorite color? Wow. I know. Just on the spot. Just well, right it's going to be red, eh? The heart. I mean, 
Listen, we've had people tow the company I'm, I'm, line. I'm, I'm, dressed, I'm dressed in white. That's <laughs> yeah, true. You dress in white. Well, look, look at this, yeah? Yeah. Hawkwood's yeah. red, so yeah, i got to go with that. Yeah. All right, very good. Towing these, the these, company the, line. These, 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 uh, these questions are simple. Keep, yeah. keep on going. God, can, you, can you hear the simple? What did you have for breakfast? I didn't. You didn't have <laughs> breakfast. I don't know if that's, a, if that's an answer. Yeah. Hmm, I mean, it's a question. Uh, what, oh. I, I could pretend. Okay. I could say. Okay. You know, well, that other idea. What what did you pretend to have for breakfast? Uh, some some toast on marmite. How was that? Oh, good. I've had uh, I've had marmite. I actually yeah. ordered some. It's pretty good. Yeah. I can't stand the stuff, but there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you either love it or you eat it. Uh huh. That's the motto. I had uh, at dinner with Brad Baker from Sound Devices, and he was like, oh, you gotta have marmite. And so I ordered some and had some on toast, and I had it like once. It. It was okay. I mean, it was Fair different. Play. You know, I'm all about trying new things, so it's all good. Um, all right, perfect. Well, I think that wraps it up for us. I don't see any questions online. Um, but, Phil, we really appreciate uh, you taking the time to talk with us. Uh, we know that Hawkwoods is always up to new things with batteries. Brilliant. And Paul is talking yeah. about, uh, you know, new future stuff for, for sound mixers, and that's, that's usually where we live. So. Oh, I appreciate you giving us the time and the opportunity to talk about Hawkwoods and the new product. So thank you so much. Very cool. Thank you. All right. Uh, stay tuned. We're going to be wrapping up our NEB coverage of 2024. So don't miss a thing.